It's a common scene around the region. Happens almost every day. Umbrellas go up, colorful boots go on. Rain comes down and the need to stay warm and dry is a constant battle. But what happens when the phone rings and you need an extra hand? Lots of people need the free hand to do your texting or answer the phone, that sort of thing. That's the problem so Carrie Cuvier had while at her son's soccer perfect. games. This started after my son started playing soccer um, and I would often be standing sideline in the rain holding my umbrella, coffee in one hand and my phone rings. And I thought to myself, wouldn't it be great if I could just come up with a way to free up that hand for my coffee? This real estate agent also needs an extra hand while out and about. She's also seen a lot of professionals with the same problem. So a year ago, she had an idea. I kind of, in joking, I said to my husband, geez, if I'm going to be standing here, because I'm always getting the coffee on the way to things, um, I need to come up with a way to get this attached to the umbrella. After being out on the soccer field, wondering what to do, and 10 prototypes later, this is the product. What normally happens is everybody just turns their head and looks and goes, oh my goodness, where'd you get it? It's called Joey on the Go, a sleeve for your coffee cup that also attaches to the umbrella and frees up your hands. It, it's been amazing. It's been really rewarding. Um, I'm really proud of our product. I think it's really practical and I think there's a need out there for it. Cuvier's mother helped her sewing the sleeve on her mother's sewing machine. It was my mother's, oh, and mother's. Okay. she got it just before uh, I was born so that she could make baby clothes for me. And it's just a, a workhorse. The mother-daughter duo have made over a hundred of these sleeves, but they knew they couldn't do it alone, so they needed to get some help. They looked south of the border for a manufacturer in the States. And with product in hand, they needed a website which recently launched. And that's when things started to take off and they started to get noticed. Joey on the Go was featured on CBC's Dragon's Den. More on that later. As for the next step, Cuvier wants to see this product take off across the country. So I can't wait to just be walking along the streets and see somebody with one, right? I think that'll be neat. In Victoria, I'm Suchetta Singh.